Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. <coughs> Kistas TV, my return subscribers. Thank you all so much for always viewing my channel. My new viewers are welcome. Yes, um, please if you not subscribe to my channel, please do well to subscribe to my channel. So I've been hearing these days that um, Olori Marian actually walked out the owner of the first three sisters out of the palace. And I was just trying to wrap my head around it. Like, um, you all know that this is a newly married um, queen. And to be ushered in into the palace and the ceremonies, if you watched, if you watched their video very well, you will see where um, one of your first sisters and their father welcomed her in. And of course, they all showed her love according to the culture and performed the rituals. So saying that she will walk out her sister-in-laws from the palace is, um, is absurd. Like, do you understand? Um, I'm just trying to wrap my head around it. Like, they've not had any encounter before. And besides, the only of the sisters, they no longer stay in the palace because of what actually happened with Queen Naomi. I think they are all distancing themselves from the palace because they don't like scandals. Just like someone said that they are always, like, they are shy people. And, yeah, it's when I mean shy. Like, they don't like drama. That is it. Not from the way you people see them, that they literally don't like drama. They try to stay away from drama. So saying that um, Olori Marian walked them out of the palace is something I don't understand. Like, okay, she's newly married. Um, this is the time she will need to bond with her sister-in-laws. And I know that, okay, Olori Marian is not someone that anyone can play with because um, she is matured. And at the, at the top of it, she's at the top of her game. Like, she has her own um, resources. When I mean resources, she has her own money. Um, she's not there for... Um, she's not actually there for anybody's money. And I actually heard that um, she's been helping the owner of the get, the get some contracts, federal government contracts. That was before they even got married. And if you saw her, she, uh, her sister's pictures... Her sister's um, pictures, like her three sisters too, you know that they are all doing well. And as she is from a wealthy um, background, a wealthy family, her mother um, being a retired policewoman and um, her uncle, the person that raised her, the person she stayed with um, when her father died, um, is also a policeman and a, a huge, I mean, um, um, a, 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 an important um, personnel in the police force. So you all know that um, she's not here to play as she's well positioned and she's not a child. Like people would always say, um, Tokwenomi is a child, she's naive and all that. She's actually prepared for this marriage. And saying she worked out her sister-in-law's from the palace, um, I don't think she would want to do that. And uh, but everybody already knows their boundaries, their limits, you know, and that is it. So um, only of the first sisters has not been coming to the palace for a while now. They come to the palace, but not to stay. And uh, of course, they will be there to support their brother. They will be there to support um, every decisions he makes. But I think they already have. Their limits, just like every other person, you know, they wouldn't want to be involved with what is happening in the palace or to say that they kept anybody uncomfortable. So, my people, this is the gist I'm hearing that only Marian kicked out her sister in laws from the palace, and the gist is not true. I don't think it is true. Um, besides, why would she want to kick out her sister's in laws from the palace? She must have been meeting them before now. Um, apart from being married to the king recently, um, she must have been visiting the palace, according to the gist. So, um, this is not this is probably not the first time she she she's meeting her sister in laws. I know that um, she must have defined this marriage, at least for the king to marry other queens to the palace. He must have given her the go ahead order. Please, sir, marry the ones you want to marry. Let us know how many we are in this palace. 
no scandals, no hidden agendas. Do you understand? I mean, she's a matured woman. She has defined the marriage the way it is so that whatever she hears something from outside, um, it won't be new to her. Do you understand? So, my beautiful people, this is the gist I said. Let me bring to your table because I'll be hearing on your FIFA's um, new wife, Olori Marian, kicked out the... Um, the sisters of on your fifa out of the palace i was like wow it can't be true um this is it so my beautiful people it is really really not true it, she cannot do that um culture and tradition wouldn't even permit her to do that those are royalties those are princesses too so they have every as as much right as she has in the palace they have it too to visit their brother the king to stay in the palace as long as they want to, as long as there is no, they are not stepping on anybody's toes, they are not crossing their boundaries, they have as much rights as she does. So, my beautiful people, once more, thank you for always being my channel, for always coming around. Please, I'm begging you, if you've not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel for more Bebeiru, for more Aproko on this space. Yes, my beautiful people, thank you once more. Have a blessed day.